Starting the day off here at Panera. Um, I like to come here and just get some work done in the morning on the laptop, read my book a little bit, and just get some planning done for the day, the week, whatever I'm going to do. And then uh, I'm going to sit here for about two hours, just knock out whatever I have to, head to the gym, get my first meal in then, and uh, then just start knocking out the rest of the stuff for the day. So the plan is just to take you guys along with me the whole day, kind of show you what today is going to be like, a day in the life of Dahab, and um, hope you enjoy. Oh, wow, I parked in the absolute worst spot when I was in Panera because the sun was just beating down on my leather seats, and when I sat in here, practically burned my back off. And also, guys, it's already 94 degrees. It's only 8, 10 in the morning. What the hell? Welcome to Maryland, where... I don't know, it just gets hot as hell and really humid sometimes. It's just, oh, it's not ideal for traveling if you're not trying to get those pit sweats and back sweat. So I always have that. I don't mind if I'm in the gym. Like, I love sweating in the gym, getting gnarly and dirty in there. You know, that's all cool. But when I'm trying to go somewhere and not smell and, you know, not be sweaty, it's kind of kind of shitty, you know. But, oh, well. Just the way of the world. But anyway, yeah, we'll have to get gas and uh, then I'm off to Exile. So I actually signed up at a new gym. You guys used to see me work out at Fit. Um, and then I've been at Forza a couple of times with my buddy Jay. And uh, I did sign up at a new gym at Exile. So it is a badass mother freaking gym. And uh, I cannot wait to get there. I will say there. though, I haven't talked to the owner yet, um, Bob, about the possibility of filming in there. Um, from what I've talked to my friend Paul, you know, he seems like he'd be okay with it. But, you know, I always want to ask him, you know, ask him if it's okay. It's his, it's his gym, it's his place. I want to make sure, you know, he's cool with it. I don't want to disrespect him or anything like that. So, hopefully he lets me film in there and uh, get some sick content. It's just it's such a motivating atmosphere. There's so many, uh, so many people around there who are on a whole other level. And it just motivates the hell out of me. It makes me a better person. And uh, my lifts have been fantastic every single time I've been there. So, very cool. Very, very cool. See that? Grab the diesel uh, pump instead of the regular. It's a little embarrassing. <laughs> yeah, but it's gonna be a gnarly chest day today. I could already feel it. Got to rain. I'm gonna drink beforehand. Get me a little energized, and then uh, I don't know. I kind of want to go for a PR. Might do the 100-pound dumbbells, or I might just look at my shoulder. But we'll see. It should be fun. So also, check out the new shirt from Bev's. I was up there last year in New York. You guys saw the video from that. Ledgers are made in the East Coast Mecca on the back. And then just the Beth Francis Powerhouse Gym logo right here. It's a very cool shirt. Very comfortable. I uh, got the triple XL because, you know, big bodies here. Or I just like oversized tees. Or both. Who knows? Join this. she blows the new exile fitness you can see it right there exile it's this whole gym right here and it's all the way back there too it's a massive gym 40,000 some square feet it's such a dope place I'm not gonna lie like it's a lifters gym you want to get a serious ass lift come here you want to get motivation come here you want to hit some fucking PRs come here shit is awesome love it love it gonna have a great lift What's going on guys? I decided to come out to a par 3 golf course today, play 9 holes, and uh, just have some fun man. Get some sunshine, some cardio. I'm all about doing cardio in a fun manner. No point in doing cardio in the gym. We got a beautiful sunny day. So this hole right here, I believe, is 130 or 140 yards. So it's the easy pitching, maybe a 9 iron, hit it soft. 
landed on the green hopefully and uh, get par. Okay, it just got hot as shit right now. The clouds were out for a while so it wasn't that bad but the sun just came out and instantly just like drenched right now. Um, it's actually 127 yards so I'm taking a 52 right now. Kind of nice easy lob and hopefully get it on the green. Fingers crossed. If I hit this tree, it would be kind of salty right now. We shall see. Okay. Where are we hitting that? Need a new club, nine iron, and a new ball. Here we go. New club. That's good. It's a beauty. On the green. So you guys, it's all about having the right club. And uh, clearly the first time I did not, and I also hit it terribly. So nice little nine iron for uh, about 127. Sweet. So that is where the first one landed. Get myself. Oh, look at that. That's beaut. And we're gonna play both those, okay? But that one was a beauty. Okay, so there's my one shot in relation to the flag. And yes, I know these greens are terrible. I almost don't even bother putting because there's no point. But this course is like eight bucks to play. So can't really complain, it's dirt cheap. And I just kind of get, get through the motions, have fun uh, coming out here and then, that shot from the fairway, not too shabby. You know, we got on the greens about a uh, about 15 footer. Now screw that, probably 15, 20 feet. Uh, that one's in the first fringe. So this one, I'm just taking my putter from the fringe. I don't trust myself with my chipping iron. I'll probably just hit it to the other side of the green. So here we go. Way too hard, way too hard. Sink this bad boy for three. Let's go. That was for par. That was for par, by the way. Let's get it. All right, guys. This one's playing 156, nine iron to the hole, and uh, just hit it sure and straight, hopefully, and then get it near the green or on it. So guys, I actually hit two from the tee. Wanted to kind of get a little more practice again. I'm out here just to have fun and also work on my golf game. I'm never, or I should say, I've never claimed to be a great golfer. I've been playing for about a year and a half now, two years. And when I say play, I mean I go to the range a few times a year and play on a course a few times a year, that's it. So pretty regular Joe when it comes to golfing, but I love uh, physical activity and sports of any nature. So uh, just having fun with this and trying to get better every time I play. So, we got one on the green here, and the other one is, uh, looks like right on the fringe or just in the rough. So I'm gonna put these into the hole, call it a day. There's the first one on the green. Not too bad. All right guys, no clue how far it is to the hole because I don't have a reader. But I'm assuming it's about 130-ish. Taking a nine iron, I'm just gonna lay it up. It is uphill, so hit a little bit harder. Hopefully, uh, that boy on the green. Just like that. Let's see what we can do. Looks good. Oh yeah, that's a beauty. That's a beauty. I hope you guys saw that. Nice little chance at a birdie. And I'd say definitely a Not too bad considering this is my first time actually playing on a course. I'm very happy with how I'm performing. This is a par four, uh, the only par four in this par three golf course. Oh, way too much juice. 
so much for a par on this bad boy. Oh! oh. You've got to be kidding me. Ah, oh, that's a gimme, but... Dude! So it was right there on the fringe behind me right there. God, that was so damn close. <sighs> Bogey, what can you do? Guys, successful day of golf. Very good. And uh, I'm sweaty, I'm hungry, I'm thirsty. So time to hydrate. So thank you for coming along with me on this golf video. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy uh, some of the shots and you know, just me going out there having fun playing a little golf. If you have any other videos you'd like to see, please, please comment down below what you would like to see in my next video, whether it be health, nutrition, just fun, you know, just doing whatever. I'm down for anything. And uh, also, if you can, please like and subscribe. Tell anyone about the channel. I'm trying to grow this family and start a good movement about people who just want to have fun, be healthy, and be their best selves, the best version of themselves with great energy and good vibes. Uplift yourself and uplift others. So take it easy. Enjoy life. Peace.